Hey Challengers, just uh, catching you up on what's going on here. We are at Newport Beach and uh, sitting out on this jetty. You can see behind me how far we are from the beach. And I'm just going to take you around on a little tour. So enjoying our time here, uh, me and Coach Joe again, Coach Joe right here. And I love this uh, part of Newport Beach, part of my sunglasses. Um, it's a place where when I do come to California, I like to come out here and just sit out here in this little jetty and, and meditate a little bit and let the waves crash up and touch some snakes apparently because somebody just had their, what kind of snake is that? Python. Well. Oh, it's gone now. Um, anyway, he uh, had a big snake out here, and uh, I put it on my neck, and and Joe touched it, faced a little bit of fears. So that's what this weekend has been about for us, uh, for a lot of things, including uh, still wearing a tank top out in public. So had some great speakers today. One was Todd Durkin. Joe Durkin. Durkin. Oh. Not gonna lie, those those come up pretty high, and uh, you know he had some. All the speakers had really good words, but of course he put a lot of energy in and and um, his passion into it, and uh, had a lot of great things to say about never quitting and um, uh, you know not being scared to fail and and living a life with purpose and intention. And I know we've all heard that before. And what does that really mean? It means are you really living? And are you are you coming out of your comfort zone? Hold on. Okay, and that one was great. Um, so living outside of your comfort zone, and I, and you know I've talked about that quite a bit. But um, you know, not being scared to fail because be, because it's in the um, it's in what comes after that moment of fear that um, enriches you and helps you to grow and to know that you you actually lived your life, that you weren't just existing. And I'm not sure I can read some of the quick notes I took down because now they are all wet. Um, <laughs> um, Be passionate about what you're doing, right? Do things with passion and purpose is what the main, the main key words that I took away from Todd Durkin's talk this morning and never give up. But you always have to enjoy what you're doing, love what you're doing, and I think that way you'll find more success in what you're doing. So yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna keep enjoying the waves splashing at me <laughs> and having fun. So see you later. Thanks, Joe. Yeah, about focusing on what makes you happy, and I know that for some of you have had that consult and and asked you, do you even know what makes you happy? And for some of us, we do not. Right? Um, we're busy, and we're, and we're busy sometimes for a reason because. We procrastinate our happiness and we don't even know what makes us happy and, and that was some thinking that I did this weekend too during some of the talks. And um, So just wanted to reach out with the motivational video. I know it really has been um, quite a journey for some of you in this challenge. I know some of you have maybe uh, you know stepped back a little bit and, and um, not put your best foot forward for a variety of reasons and whatever and and uh, you know not judging or I, I've done the same thing over and over and over again in my life so um, not judging but just understanding that you know each time you step out step out a little bit further and you can't get it all right the first time and there are going to be setbacks and not to beat yourself up about them and and, and negative self-talk about your week and and uh, things like that just just yeah just to uh, take a look at your patterns and figure out why you're sabotaging yourself. Why are, why are you holding you or yourself back from that which you desire, require, and deserve? Um, love is the most powerful force of the planet. And when you withhold that from yourself, you withhold a whole bunch of amazing um, experiences and opportunities. So you remember to love yourself enough to know that you deserve the best. To love yourself enough to know that you deserve the unlimited um, um, opportunities that are coming your way but sometimes you have to work for them because they're not going to knock on your door either so 
don't be scared to step out. Don't be scared to try to be someone who you didn't think you could ever want to be, but wanted to be. Um, just, just trust and know the process, and um, no, trust the process and know that you know each each little baby step at a time is going to get you to where you need to be. So with that, I'm going to. Uh, shut down here and do a little bit more meditating because I am at one of the most favorite spots of mine in the whole wide world. Not that I've traveled much, but in all my travels, this is one of my favorite spots to be right here in this very spot. So I'm going to sit and enjoy it for a few minutes before we take on the rest of the beach this um, Sunday evening. So have a good week and uh, see some of you soon. Bye.